at five, a 35 year old Joe Blackburn, a suspect accused of shooting a man three times in the stomach in North Tulsa is out on bond. He was arrested at his mother's house in Jinx last week after a standoff with police. It was quite the ordeal and today neighbors say they see coming and going from the house. Two works for you anchor Corey Duke is live in Jinx talking with some who are frightened. Corey. Brian and Cheryl, on Thursday, there was a heavy police presence in this neighborhood. In fact, residents tell me they couldn't even turn onto their streets. A standoff happening just up the road from here is giving residents, they say, another reason to want to pack up and move. Oh, oh. The man shot in the stomach and reports of a suspect on the run. He took the weapon with him. He was definitely armed. Joel Blackburn accused of shooting someone during a drug deal near the 500 block of North Norwood and leading police to a standoff in Jinx. The information spread across television screens throughout green country. I was watching it and I saw that house and I was like, that looked familiar. Standoff for a suspected gunman unfolded right outside his window and Jinx police surrounded the neighborhood. On one hand, it's crazy. On the other hand, it shocked me. Residents were forced to clear the area as Jinx police and U.S. Marshals took Blackburn into custody. Neighbors say they were relieved until he was released back into the community two days later, $30,000 bond. That's a pretty dangerous person that is able to get out of jail that quickly. Residents in the area now on edge knowing Blackburn is back home. People are talking about cameras and security and things like that. We protect ourselves with uh, guns here, uh, but uh, so if any, so if he tried to come down here, we'll, we'll be able to, you know, protect herself. Neighbors say Blackburn's return home is just the icing on the cake to the ongoing crime issue in the area. My cars have been broken into twice. We've had vandalism. I mean, it's just not the neighborhood I thought I moved into. There has been a few. Uh, Break, uh, thefts of cars, um, but not on a big scale like that, that someone shot someone else. And for some residents, enough is enough. We've already looked at a property and, and intend to move within the next year. Right now, Blackburn faces charges of assault and battery with a deadly weapon, and no court date has been set at this time. Reporting live in Jenks, Corey Duke, two works for you.